Hey guys, this is Ian Alexander, and today I'm going to show you how to create your first TechWaru queue. So here we have the TechWaru user interface. On the left hand side we have the different categories of tools that you can select. And then for each of those categories we have a list of tools and their descriptions. We're going to go through each category and select the tools that we want to run and add them to a queue. So first I'm going to clear this queue and then we'll go to the system information tab and we'll add a few tools. So the first one I want to add is get product keys. And then we'll add what in startup and win crash report. This will give us some basic information about the computer and then we can move on to the hardware diagnostics section. I might run a one run battery info view, but just in case I don't know exactly what this does, I can click this description and I get a full box here that will update as I go through each tool. Let's also add a blue screen view and then move on to the pre-malware section. I might want to back up the registry, which is always a good idea. So I'm going to add that there, but I want to run this first. So I'm going to click and hold and drag it up to the top. Let's say I accidentally add a tool and I want to remove it. I can either click this left arrow or just double click on the tool. If I don't know where a tool is, I can use the search functionality. And let's go ahead and find everything that relates to the registry. And here we have a list of those tools, or maybe I want to find everything related to malware. And if I go through each of these, I can see the description, and then I can add it to the queue. Now that I have a list of tools that I want to run, I can either save it as a preset so that I can load it later, or I can just click Start. Once I click Start, it'll run through each of the tools sequentially, and I can walk away and have a cup of coffee and come back to a full report. So let's go ahead and click Start here and see what happens. As you can see, it's running through each of the tools and then moving on to the next one. If the tool isn't already downloaded onto the computer, it will download it for us and then run it. Now that it's done, it's generated our first report and we can go and see what each of the tools did. 